guys, it's me, Aubrey, from Fun and Crazy Kids, and if you remember a couple videos back, or it's not a couple video videos, anyways, a video we posted, we found this little bat-like creature when we were looking for Batman. So I'm gonna insert that clip now if you guys have not seen that video. You guys ready Wait, for- Wait, what is that? I see you see that in the tree? I don't see anything. Look up there. Watch out because it could like, it could crawl towards you. I'm gonna make it mad. Oh ah. my, Aubrey, if you bring it towards me, I'm gonna die. <gasps> you saw that little clip you should go watch that video after this video because it's it's pretty crazy anyways we found this weird bat like little creature thing and my mom wanted to bring it home why i don't know it's creepy and ugly and it's disgusting but she brought it home anyways and now i'm trying to figure out what to do with it in our house i don't know if it's alive i don't know if it's a decoration but it's creeping me out and I think it's Batman. My mom doesn't think it's Batman. She just thinks it's a cute little decoration. I think it's Batman. I think he's tricking us, and I think he's coming for us, and I think this is what he's always wanted. So I'm gonna try to figure out what it is. So let's go find it, because I don't know where my mom put it. Okay, okay, looking for Caleb. Have you seen a bat-like creature anywhere? Like, it's like a really ugly bat thing. I don't know how to explain it. Oh, like, does it have a broom, a stick on its feet? Ma yes, yes, it does. You've seen it? Yes. Where? It was flying around while I was playing Minecraft. And what? Was like, what is that? What? What do you mean it was flying around? Caleb, what do you mean it was flying around? Uh, it was like, <laughs> Okay, where exactly did you see the bat end up flying to? Uh, outside. Uh, outside, which way? Front, uh, back? Front. Okay, I, I need to get mom. Thanks, Caleb! Mom! What? Mom! What? What? Okay, you know how last video we found, or a couple videos ago, we found that little bat Don't thing that me. you wanted to bring home? Yeah? And you and you thought it was a cute little he decoration. He was cute! Well, Caleb has just informed me that it was flying around the living room. <gasps> It wasn't alive. It was like a fake thing. Well, Caleb doesn't lie. Caleb, so what is happening? Caleb, did you really see yep. the bat thing? Yep. What? I asked him if he saw a bat, and he said, "Oh yeah, the one, something flying around." I was like, "What? Where did you see it, Caleb?" It. He said it flew out to the front yard. That. Where was it flying in the house? Uh, by me. By you. What but if the bat, bat like picked him as it's like pet or something you know how some like people or some like witches and wizards and stuff have fami familiars what if bats pick their own humans and that's what, what that did to caleb this is crazy we I, i'm gonna look in the front yard to see if i can find right. a bat gotta unlock the door are you ready <sighs> okay before i go out there guys i need you to like this video in five four three two one. Did you do it? I hope so. Now, we're gonna go risk my life looking for this bat creature that supposedly was flying around. Oh, pumpkins, pumpkins. Okay, I do not see anything. I see more pumpkins. Do you guys see anything? I need you to tell me if you see anything because I need to know. Nothing so far. Well, if Caleb said it flew out here, where is it? Okay, so far, I see nothing. No bats, no sign of bats. What do bats even do? Where do bats live? Wouldn't there be like, I thought bats, they like sleep during the day and come out at night. And they like use echolocation. But you can't really use echolocation in a neighborhood. You gotta be in a cave or somewhere that it echoes. So why would a bat be flying around? Or how would a bat be flying around my house? There's something wrong with this house. There's something up with this house. Something mysterious and creepy. I really can't find this bat. I have no idea where the bat is, and that's bad, because what if I just go to sleep tonight, and then I wake up, and there's a bat sucking my blood, and I, like, turn into, like, a, a vampire. Okay, Caleb's in there playing on his iPad, and I think I need to ask him some questions. Caleb! What? So you know how you know everything about everything, yeah. right? Yeah. Well, is this bat, is this a vampire? Is the bat that was flying around you a vampire? Mm. Let me see. He has to think about it. 
Is he a vampire? Yep. What? So, so far we know that the bat is actually not a decoration and it's alive. And it's not an animal, it's a vampire. So, that's just fantastic. So if it's a vampire and it's alive, and we thought it was oh, yeah, not it alive. It's it, target is you. What is that even? What? So he's gonna suck your blood. Whoa, whoa, his target, me? Yep. What are you talking, how do you know that? I just don't. How? The bad guy, the vampire told me. Whoa, the bat. Is it the Batman? Yeah. Oh no, okay, I have to tell Mom. Okay, okay where is he? Mom, what? Did you see Mom. anything? Guess what Caleb just told me. What? Caleb just told me, so not only is the bat thing alive, but it's not a bat, it's the Batman. And Caleb said I'm its target and it's gonna suck my blood. So what does that even mean? Um, we're moving. We're moving. We have to! We're moving! Guys, I need you to like and subscribe to this video because I need some support after finding out that I am the supposed target of the Batman. Why is it, why am I always the target? Why is it always in me? Why? We need to move now. Okay, well my mom takes it upon herself to find out where to move to because this is not gonna work. We gotta do some searching. We gotta do some deep diving about the Batman. So I'm gonna look up the Batman on my phone here, okay? Batman, not Batman, Batman! Should I do, is it urban legend? Hmm, okay. Okay, I cannot find anything. Why is it all about Batman and Gotham City? Okay, this is not the Batman that I need. Why is it all comics? I'll be back when I find the real Batman and not the fake phony Batman that isn't targeting me. I found something and it's called the man bat and that's pretty much Batman, right? So a half man, half bat like creature, the man bat was previously thought to have been only a myth mythological beast. Well, obviously it's not a myth because it's in my house right now targeting me. Refer to in stories and fairy tales. It's not okay. Whoa. There has been, until recently, there has been, until recently, so that means they have found evidence. The existence of man bats? Obscured photographs? The man bats have been lurking around farms and sometimes neighborhoods. If you come into path with a man bat, there's not much you can do if he's already targeted you. What? Okay, 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 okay. So it says if he hasn't targeted you, you can easily tell the Batman to go away and he will. But if he has targeted you, which is a high possibility if you're reading this right now, Oh, they know their stuff. And... It ends. The article ends. Why does the article end? And... So apparently I'm being targeted by a half man, half bat. Um, he's gonna get me. Um, will I survive the night? That's the real question of the, of the day. So guys, this is, this is sad. This is horrible. Um... Also, we are on Cameo, so if you want to book a Cameo before I am gone forever because the Batman eats me or something, you should book that. I do birthdays, special messages, just really anything. I do anything on Cameo that you guys want. So yeah, um, I'm gonna hope for the best tonight and hope that I survive. And because if I don't, I guess you won't be hearing from me again. So like this video and subscribe. Um, Please out!